who has seen me has seen the Father. So Jesus Christ is saying, the Father is in me. When you see me, you see the Father. Do not believe that I... Don't you believe that I am in the Father and that the Father is in me? The words I say to you are not just my own. Rather, it is the Father living in me who, has, who is doing His work. Believe me when I say that I am in the Father and the Father is in me. Or at least believe on the evidence of the miracles themselves. Everyone here, for you to be in, in, in church or to even just feel the, who has felt the love of Jesus Christ? Hallelujah! Raise your hand. <laughs> the reason why you have felt the love of Jesus Christ is because of your belief in the word that God has given you. That's the only reason why you have felt his love. Without, without you believing in God or his word, somebody has all preached the gospel to everyone in here. It's up to you to accept it because remember, we're the keepers of our own hearts. And I pray that you guys will accept the word of God. The word of God is true. The good news of God is true. I'm going to start saying Jesus. The good news of Jesus is true. His lifestyle is true. Everyone, everyone in the earth knows that this guy, Jesus, has came to, to the earth. Everyone in the world, they speak of Jesus. In school, me and Paris was talking, me, Pastor Sandy, and Renisha was talking in the car, and, and I remember in the seventh grade, we only preached about Jesus for two days. I mean, not preached, but we only studied the Christianity religion for two days. Because the parents felt that their children should not listen to the message. There's too much power in the gospel. They don't, they don't understand. They preach. We study the Muslim religion for two months. They don't care about that. It's not the truth. But for Christianity, we got to spend two days. Otherwise, people will start believing in God's God. I pray that you guys will open up your hearts to the good news. This is something that we have been entrusted with. We have Charles. We have to hold on to the good news. This is something that will lift you up. This is something that will exalt you. Just like Jesus Jesus himself, this is a thought, this is a thought, just, just think about it. If Jesus Christ did not believe who he was, he would have went to the same place that he created. If you, if you think about it, because how can, he came on the earth and he had to obey his own word. own word, that means he had to believe in himself as being the son of man. He had to keep that testimony. This is the only reason why they killed him. Because he had that testimony, that he was God. Am I right? Doing good, Chris. That was, that was, that, that was the message. I mean, I read all these scriptures, and you know, um, I guess since the, 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 the story, the, the whole message was about the heart, my uncle, my uncle, I was trying to, I was trying to preach the message to him one day, and, and he said that I was thinking more than I was believing in what I was saying. So, this, this, that be, this was before I, I knew that I had to give a message. 
You know, um, he had told me, if you don't believe in the words that you are preaching to me, why should I believe in the words that you are giving me? If you don't, if you or if you are constantly trying to come up with ways on persuading me and not believing in what you are saying, why should I believe in what you are saying? Open your hearts to the gospel, the good news of Jesus Christ. He said, let the Son of Man be glorified so that the Father will be glorified. The word that he has given you, he gave Jesus a word. You are the Son of Man. Live holy until you die. We all have been given the word of God, Brian. You have been given the word of God and it's up to you to accept the word that is in you. You already have the word. Okay? Yeah. Open up your hearts to the good news and live according to the word. Live according to the gospel of God. Always look always looking in the word because that's something that Jesus did himself. He had to look in here to find out who he was. Even though the angel had told his mom, you are the son of the living God. You are the almighty, help me out with this, almighty, almighty God, almighty God. You are the almighty God. I'm sure his mother told him that, but he had to believe the message also. Believe in the word that you have been given and you'll be saved. Amen. 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 Amen.